The new global arms race isn't about missiles or oil, it's about microchips. Every country on Earth is scrambling to build more chip fabs, and the reason is simple chips are the new oxygen of the modern world. They power everything phones, cars, hospitals, AI, satellites, fighter jets, entire economies collapse without them. And during the 2020 to 2022 chip shortage, the world learned a hard lesson whoever controls the chips, controls the future. Right now, 90% of the world's most advanced chips come from one place, Taiwan. That makes governments nervous. Really nervous. So the U.S.China, Japan, South Korea, and Europe are throwing hundreds of billions of dollars into new fabs. Not just to boost supply, but to secure national security, protect industries, and avoid depending on anyone else for the brains of every modern device. Chip fabs are insanely expensive, insanely complex, and take years to build but the country that masters them gets the ultimate advantage. Technological power. Economic power, military power. This is why the race is on and why the next global superpower might be decided not on the battlefield but inside clean rooms. If you're enjoying this, hit subscribe so you don't miss the next one.